What's up guys? This is Jean 101. In this video, we are going to learn how to validate a date on Delphi using any date format. So, let's get started. Say you have a date like this one and you want to validate to check if it's valid. I will first run the program to show what I mean. So here I have a valid date using the format day, month, year. If the date is valid, then it says it's okay. If I put a invalid day, for example, it says it's not valid. So let's see how to do it. All I did here is to create the is valid date function. Let's see how it works. This function receives a string with the date. The date has to be in the day, month, year format, but you can change for any format as you wish. Okay. First, I check using regular expression if there is a match between the date I received and the following regular expression. Number, one or two numbers followed by a hyphen, one or two numbers followed by a dash, and then four numbers. Okay, this is the date as I want to receive. You can change this for the format you want. Now, if there is no match, the date is invalid, then return false. <coughs> if there is a match, I will try to convert the date string to a Delphi date. Let's see how to do it. First, I create a string list variable, the type is t string list, then I create it, I instantiate it. After that, I set the delimiter parameter of this object to hyphen. You may change it for whatever symbol you want to use, but remember to change it both here and here in the regular expression. Okay. Now I set the delimited text of this object to the date I received as parameter. And then now I have a vector in the first position of the array. I have the day, then I have the month for the second position and finally the year. Now is the trick. I use the day, month, year to create another string using the day, month, year, and using the slashes. Now, all I have to do is to try to convert the string I just created using the str to date function. If everything is okay, the result will be true. If there is an exception, the result will be false. So, it's that simple. This way, you can validate your date using any format. Okay? If you like this video, please give it the thumbs up. Thank you for watching.